or let me start new chapter sets and uh, functions now first i am going to finish five marks in functions not only in model papers and we are going to cover all the problems which are given in public papers also okay now first sum listen carefully let a is equal to set containing the elements 0 1 2 3 and b is another set which contains the element 1 3 5 7 9 b the two sets now they are referring a function f a to b given by this is the rule they are following f of x is equal to 2x plus 1 what is the use of this one you can calculate the image of each and every element present in set a because a function is defined always from set a to set b now represent this function as the set of ordered pairs next a table next an arrow diagram next a graph that means what there are so many ways are there to represent a function in that first one is set of ordered pairs that is a usual way of representing a function second one is table by using table like x value corresponding y value third one is an arrow diagram normal way of representing the function fourth one is by using a graph now we will see one by one so now f of x is given as 2x plus 1 first all the images of the elements present in a should be calculated so f of 0 because that is the first element 2 into 0 plus 1 nothing but 1 so what is the meaning of this one image of 0 is 1 similarly f of 1 that is your next element 2 into 1 plus 1 that is equal to 2 plus 1 3 because 2 into 1 2 only plus 1 so 2 plus 1 3 next what is the image of next element f of 2 third element 2 into 2 plus 3 so 4 plus 3 nothing but 7 so what is the next element 3 so f of 3 2 into 3 plus sorry this is a plus 1 only because it won't change 4 plus 1 5 similarly 2 into 3 plus 1 that is 6 plus 1 7 so first you should calculate the image of all, all the elements present in set a so once you calculate the images then you can represent different ways what is the first one set of ordered pairs set of ordered pairs f is equal to order pair means x value y value what is x value here 0 what is the corresponding image 1 so 0 1 that is your first ordered pair like order pair is very simple x value corresponding image value that is the way it should represent next for 1 what is the image 3 so 1 comma 3 next for 2 what is the image 5 2 comma 5 for 3 what is the image 7 3 comma 7 this is very simple way of representing a function now second one <coughs> a table see in the table simply x value and f of x value so now what are the x values these are the values 0 1 2 3 now what about f of x values f of x or y also you can represent that doesn't matter now f of x value f of 0 1 because the image of 0 is 1 the image of 1 is 3 so 3 you write down here what is the image of 2 5 so 5 you write down here next what is the image of 3 7 simple very simple what are all the values you are getting in the order pair those values you should uh, write down in the form of a table so x uh, f of x what is third one arrow diagram arrow diagram is very very simple an arrow diagram an arrow diagram so in arrow diagram First, you write down the elements present in set A. 
and uh, you write down the elements present in set B. So, what are the elements present in set A? These are the elements 0, 1, 2, 3. What are all the elements present in set B? 1, 3, 5, 5, 7, 9. Now, you have to do the mapping from A to B so that the image of 0 is 1. So, 0 is mapped with 1 or you can tell the image of 0 is 1. What is the image of 1? 3 because that is the image you already calculated here. What is the image of 2? 5 because previously they used to put the arrow mark in the middle of the line but now nowadays they are using inside this uh, set B. So, that does not matter. Okay. Now, what about next one? 2 is much 3. 3 should be matched with the 7. Even though 9 is left unmatched, it is a function only because the main condition for a function is all the elements in set A should be matched. No element in set A should be left unmatched, but it may be left unmatched in set B that does not matter. So, this is the one way of representing the functions. So, we already finished three ways. What is the first way? The set of ordered pairs that is very easiest way. Once you find the images, write down the form of order pairs. Second one, tabular column that is also very easy. Only thing is x and f of x you should write down. An arrow diagram by using arrows. Now, fourth one by using graph. Graph means these points uh, roughly you should uh, plot. See here. Now, this is x axis. Now, this is y axis. <coughs> now, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 like this. Just to plot on x axis. Like you, you can write the scale on x axis one unit uh, that uh, you are going to discuss in graph. But here simply you have to plot those points enough. Okay. For 0, what is the image A? 1? Suppose this is 0, this is 1. This is order pair 0, 1. Now, what about next one? What is the image of 1? 3. So, this is 1, 3 is this one. So, 1, 3. What about the next one? For 2, what is the image A? 5. So, 2, the image is 5. So, next one 3, 7. For 3, what is the image? 7. Very simple, like we are plotting the points in the graph sheet now. You have to plot, plot the points taking roughly the coordinate system. So, the total all the points represent a graph, means this point, this point, this point, this point. So, instead of putting that uh, cross symbol, you can put dot symbol also, that does not matter. Okay. So, these are the four ways are representing. So, this one, fourth one by using graph or by graphical representation. That is it, very, very simple. So, listen one more time. First elements they are given in set A and some of the elements they are given in set B. Then we have to represent in set of order by stable uh, arrow diagram graph. Then you find the images by replacing x in this formula. In that images, you write down set of order pairs. Next table, x value, f of x value. Next arrow diagram, those values you should write in the form of an arrows with those images. That is this one. Fourth one, like this graph, like coordinate system you should plot. By taking x and y axis, plot the numbers on x and y axis, like 1 centimeter, 1 unit. Then what are all the images you got, what are all the order pairs you got, represent like a point. <coughs> we will see the next problem.